and welcome to the Shark Theater. Today my guest is Jake Hager, and he's my, and we're going to be talking about wrestling. Yeah! Okay, how did you get started with wrestling? I had two older cousins that were much older than I was, and I really looked up to, and they were very good at wrestling, so I fell in love with it um, from a young age. Oh, that's how you did it? Well, that's how I started amateur wrestling, and then I started uh, uh, continuing on with that, and I got a job with WWE when I graduated college. Not the oh, kind of job you think you, you get when you graduate college. Mm-hmm. No. But it, it was great. Uh, and I got to work there for 12 years with a lot of really good, really cool people and see a lot of cool places in the world. Okay. Have you seen some of his uh, WWE matches? i see seen lots of the WWE matches. Yes. How'd I do? Pretty good, but you lost them. I'll take that, you know. What are you going to do? But you want Finley. I beat Finley. I did beat Finley. Remember uh, Finley had the shillelagh with yeah, the stick? Yeah, and, and he threw his um, son into the barricade. <laughs> uh, I think that's just his friend. I don't think it was his son. <laughs> yeah, don't worry. About but that, 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 little g- that, the- that little guy would climb to the top rope and jump on me and it was like a brick landing on me. Hey, you had some other questions? Okay. Uh, what, who are your favorite wrestlers? Top five favorite? Um, well, secret, I love NWO. I love Kevin Nash, Scott Hall, uh, Hogan, Xbox, the Wolfpack, they're, they're my favorite, but I usually get kicked out of the room for telling people that, but Kevin Nash is my favorite, and then it goes to a guy named Danny Hodge, which was an Oklahoma wrestler. Daddy Matt Hulk Hogan. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I did. He just loves randomly ins- inserting that uh, into every <laughs> conversation, but uh, what are your this, top, is, this is about... Uh, what are your top five, two favorite moves? Um... One is the ankle lock. Kurt and Angle? The, yep, Kurt Angle. Oh, I should say Kurt Angle. He's my, actually, he's my real favorite wrestler because uh, I like the way he wrestles and all the counters he can do. So the ankle lock and then my new finish, which is the Joe C. headlock, the arm triangle. And oh. I do it, and I do it like in a rock bottom into the arm triangle. Oh. Um, but I, I haven't came up with a name for it yet. So instead of the rock bottom, it's a triangle, and you pull them down like a... a I, I rock bottom them, and then I choke them out with the arm triangle afterwards. Oh. That's pretty yeah. impressive. What's your favorite, Ollie? My favorite wrestlers are top five. John Cena, The Rock, and who was? And a big show. Oh, he's good. Jack Swagger. Oh. <laughs> and MVP. MVP. Nice, nice. What do you like about MVP? He does this little basketball elbow thing. Yeah. Balling. He's a very good wrestler. Him and I learned together back in 2006. Yeah. It was a little before your time, Wally. <laughs> Wally, tell, uh, uh, tell Jake about your favorite finishing moves. What are your favorite finishers? My favorite finishing moves is the people's elbow and the... What is his um, bomb called? Oh, he Covered. does the... Uh, what did you call your uh, ankle lock? Was it the Patriot? Oh, the, the Patriot lock, yes. Yeah, that was your uh, ankle lock, right? But what, what what other locks do you like, Ollie? Uh, ankle lock. Well, which one? Remember the the first one you learned. Headlock. No, no, on Ric Flair's move. Oh. 
It's a, it's, it uh, will we'll give you a clue to the number involved. Uh, figure four. That's right. There you go. And, and the name of your show, of your podcast, is your... Shark Tooth. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> now we're here. Now we're there. Well, that's cool. I really, I really like Big Show as well. The first time I saw him, I just couldn't believe how big he was. He was ginormous. And Mark Henry. And Mark Henry, yeah. You know. One time, um, I didn't move her out of the way in time, and Mark Henry landed on me with all of his weight. But he, he saved my, he saved my life because he caught himself at the last second, and he didn't give me everything he had. But I was definitely sore the next day. Oh. Can you imagine, you imagine that? <laughs> Jinx. <laughs> well, you know, Ollie, you've seen some big guys and you've yeah. seen some little guys. But what's most impressive to me, to Daddy, about Jake's wrestling is he's a big guy that can move. He was athletic and he, he, yeah, he no, could actually he, wrestle. It wasn't just all about his size. He could wrestle more than any player. Than most guys, for sure. Some guys are just big. More than John Cena, I'll tell you that, Ollie. <laughs> oh. Oh, ho, ho. <laughs> right there, Ollie. Calling out your guy. Yep. A any other questions you have, Ollie? Would you say, uh, is Jake, uh, is he, what do we call bad guys? Uh, heels? Yeah, ask him. Are you a heel? It is, it's a lot of fun to be a heel, and so, yes, I am. And I ask him what the good guys are called. What are the good guys called? The good guys are called baby faces. <laughs> 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 Obviously, I don't have one. Maybe if I shave. What do you want to be, Ollie? A face or a heel? Heel. Yeah. <laughs> I want to be the bad guy. They're, they're both a lot of fun. It's um, really hard to get people to cheer for you. It's, uh, it's easier to get people to boo you. But either way, it's a lot of fun. Now, Ollie, do you know, um, do you know where Jake wrestles today? What organization? I know. What, what is it? Where do you wrestle now? Uh, AEW. All Elite Wrestling. AEW. Yep, and okay. we have a big pay-per-view this Saturday, and we're having a stadium stampede match in it. Doesn't that sound interesting, Ollie? Yeah. We're stadium gonna be wrestling stampede. inside an NFL stadium. Stadium like football. Yep. Okay. And we're gonna have football uniforms on, and it's gonna be pretty wild. You're gonna wrestle? Yep. No football? <laughs> no, it's gonna be like five on five. The group I'm involved in with like, Chris you, Jericho. You could do your finishing moves? Yep. So you could do ankle lock? I'm gonna do the Ollie lock. There we go. Yeah. There we go. What's the Ollie lock anyway? It's the ankle lock at AEW. Renamed hey, it. We're going to have to watch, right? It's this Saturday. Okay. We're going to okay. watch. And uh, you know that Jake works with um, Daddy now, too. Yeah. Um, and where does Daddy work? Uh, Bellator. That's right. You want to yeah. ask Jake some Bellator questions? Okay. Uh, do you like Bellator more or wrestling? Uh, I'm more of a I'm more of a MMA guy uh, at heart. It's real easy for me to get in there and work hard. The acting with with pro wrestling is is very tough at times. You got to be funny and you got to be in front of the cameras. But uh, I think I'm more of an MMA Bellator guy. Okay. Do you know how hard that is to do, Ollie? Only a few guys have ever been able to do both. MMA and wrestling? It's so hard. Okay. What do you think? Yeah. <laughs> what are your top five favorite fighters? Oh, well, there we go. Um, I'd have to say uh, Josh Rafferty oh. is uh, my number one favorite fighter. 
uh, Rich Franklin, <laughs> Rob Bradford. <laughs> Just going down the list. Uh, and then we'll go Ryan Bader and uh, uh, Douglas Lima. Wow. That's quite a list, huh? My favorite right here. I don't know, I don't know that many. I only know one, Cass Bell. <laughs> Who is it? Cass Bell. Oh, yes. He's one of our, he's one of our uh, Bantam weights, Jake, uh, one, 135er. This, uh, Ollie, this is uh, my Ooh. five-year-old. Her name is Presley. Hi. <laughs> Hi, Presley. How are you? <laughs> Ollie, say hello. I did. Well, <laughs> you know how to speak. You, you all nervous now? No. I'm no, blushing. you're not. <laughs> Hey, kiddo, how are you? She really likes the girl fighters, Ollie. Do you know the uh, the Eliminator, Lemele McFarlane? Nope. Yes, you oh. do. You've been to two of her fights in Hawaii. Yeah, I remember. Um, yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, that's, that's Presley's favorite fighter. No kidding. Hi there. <laughs> Look at her. <laughs> the kids are taking over, Jake. Yeah. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Well, Ollie, uh, what do you say to uh, Mr. Jake? He's he's got to go train and and get ready and prepare and work hard for his uh, match on Saturday. But he gave us some of this of this valuable time. What do you want to say? Thank you for being on my podcast. Yeah, man! Congratulations on having a podcast. That's really impressive. I actually have Wild World. Whoa! I'm gonna have a Pokemon podcast. Oh yeah. My yeah, we got podcast fever over here, Jake. Uh, he's uh, so Wild World is his podcast about on animals. on wild animals and but Pokemon is going to be about animals actually, but Pokemon instead. Oh, uh-huh, cool! Wow, that's Very awesome. Nice. Well, hey, Good Jake. Luck with that, Ollie. Thank you so much for your time, bud. Uh, he's going to sign off now, right, Ollie? Yeah. Time All right. I'll I'll, I'll retweet this from my next account. Time okay. I'm on shark shooter. And, and uh, what? Is it? Go ahead, but finish up. It was a nice time having you on the podcast, and so maybe we could do this again someday. Bye bye. Love you. Bye. Thank you. Thanks, Welcome. Jake. You're the man, buddy. Appreciate this. Thank you, Ollie. Thank you, Rich. Bye. Bye.